Hi, this is Paul from MaxBartTraining.com and this is a scalping tutorial really. We're looking at the expert Elgo and then the manager to manage the trades, but more overly uh, a little bit of a tutorial using our bias depth heat map here. So it's on the scalping settings. We have settings for scalping, day trading and swing trading. This is gold on the one minute. So like any strategy, any signal strategy, there are uh, instances where you wouldn't take uh, a trade even though the the algorithm is telling you to take the trade so one of the things we wanted to do is have a go no go gauge and so uh, with the expert algo we get some great signals but we need a bit of a backup so this is why we developed this um, heat map so it's in six levels uh, so from the top this is the smallest time frame and then it, as you go down you get higher and higher and a higher time frame so it looks on multiple time frames and gives you that heat map to where the bias is. If it's yellow, it's neutral. If it's red, it's bare. If it's green, it's bullish. So I'm going to go through just a few trades today. from today. I'm going to first look at this uh, five and six star buy signal here on the expert algo. Uh, look down onto the heat map. All six levels, all six time frames are green. You go. You enter the trade at this point here, uh, there. Okay, now then we use the manager to manage the trade. So we continue to look at this ribbon here, the green ribbon, and when it turns red, we take the trade out again. So then it comes back down. We get a six star sell at this point here, but look, look at the heat map. We are yellow, we're neutral on that higher time frame there. It's telling you not to go. What does it do? Turn around. We keep going, we pull back down. Then we get a six star buy signal at this point here. The whole bias depth heat map is green. So all six time frames are bullish bias. You take the trade and you're still in this trade right now. So this trade was taken at 1958.9 and we're at 1968.4 so nearly 100 ticks on a one minute time frame why are we still in it because the ribbon for the manager has remained green therefore it is telling you to stay in the trade so the first one was what you would call a normal scalp probably 15 20 ticks because the ribbon changed red but you never know when a run is going to come. All you're going to do is get the signal. You're going to get the confirmation from that, uh, the bias heat map there. Then you're going to enter the trade. And then you've got to trust the manager to keep you in the trade. Okay. Sometimes it may be only a 10, 15 tick scalp. But if that ribbon continues to go green, you stay in this trade. Just adjust your stops below each pivot as it goes up here. Okay. Now, where would we adjust the stop right now? To be honest, I'd be a little bit more aggressive. I'd probably look at this sort of level here. Okay, so we've got this pivot. I would say if that was previous resistance, probably going to be support. It's below that ribbon right now, so I'd be quite aggressive now because we're scalping, remember, with that trailing stop. But we've made a hundred ticks off a scalp. All goes back to the setup. The setups are the same. You never know when it's going to run. Again, go no-go gauge. Here we have a six star buy, you go. A little winner. Six star sell, we don't go because the bias heat map is telling us not to go. It then turns around, we get a six star buy on the expert algo, and it goes. All the bias on the all six time frames are green, you go, and then the manager has kept you in this trade and it's a monster trade. So you just got to keep probing with those scalps with the expert algo signals managing it with the manager and remember those signals get confirmation from that bias depth heat map hopefully that helps speak to you all really soon